Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. In this video, we will see the question paper for the subject Research and Publication Ethics of VTU PhD coursework examination for the year October 2021. So in module 1, the questions was define philosophy and explain the nature of philosophy. Write a note on ethics and explain the terms moral philosophy, meta ethics, normative ethics and applied ethics. In our choice for module 1, we have mentioned some philosophical objectives behind research. Write notes on nature of moral judgment and nature of ethical reactions in research. In module 2, explain ethics with respect to normative science and positive science. Write a brief note on intellectual honesty. The odd choice in module 2 was explain common types of scientific misconducts. What is plagiarism? State any possible six reasons for plagiarism. In module 3, what is meant by conflict of interest in research? Explain the occurrence of financial and non-financial conflict of interest. This was asked for 10 marks. Explain the publication of explain the publication ethics in research. This was asked for 10 marks. The odd choice was what are the best practices to be followed by good journals for 10 marks? What is a predatory publisher? What are the common characteristics of predatory publishers? This was asked for 10 marks. In module 4, what are open access journals? Explain the difference between full open access journals and hybrid journals. This was asked for 10 marks. Define plagiarism. Explain the functioning of Urkund and Turnitin. This was asked for 10 marks. And then in module 4, the odd choice question was what are the most common complaints of predatory publications? This was asked for 10 marks. And what is the significance of the database RPMEO? Explain the indications of the green color with archive preprint and archive post print. This was asked for 10 marks. In module 5, what are the differences between site score and impact factor? This was asked for 10 marks. Define I-10 index. State any four advantages and any four disadvantages of I-10 index. This was asked for 10 marks. And in the R choice, define G index. Mention any four advantages and four constraints of G index. This was asked for 10 marks. Explain the terms H index and I-10 index. Illustrate on the entries 254, 169, 8, 7, 6, to represented in the following table. A table is given in which all citations is given as 254. Since 2016 it is 169. H index is mentioned as 8. Since 2016 it is 7. I10 index is mentioned as 6. Since 2016 it is mentioned as 2. So we need to illustrate H index and I10 index on the, using this following entries. That is all the question paper for 2021 for research and publication ethics for more such phd coursework question paper videos do subscribe to the channel and like the video see you in my next video until then take care bye bye